Greenville High took on North Lamar last Friday night in front of a home crowd. The Lions chose to receive to start the ball game. They would go on to march down the field in an eight play drive, totaling 73 yards, ending in a touchdown. Greenville managed to stop North Lamar on their first possession of the game, but the Panthers would recover a fumble on the Greenville 41-yard line and start on a drive of their own. North Lamar scored quickly on the 37-yard run by quarterback Jay Walters. Greenville Lions struck back with a 40-yard kick return and a 17-yard run by Caleb Jarvis. He was tackled in the end zone, losing his helmet. North Lamar followed up with a 20-yard kick return, placing them at the 47-yard line. The Panthers answered with a 53-yard drive, ending in a 3-yard touchdown handoff to Jeremiah Gunther. On the following drive, Greenville scored again on a long run, bringing the score to 21-14 Lions late in the second quarter. Just before halftime, the Panthers opted for the field goal after not being able to convert on the third down. After halftime, North Lamar chose to go for a two-point conversion following a touchdown. Later down the stretch, quarterback Caleb Jarvis connected with Carter Mulkey for a 15-yard gain, being pushed out of bounds by Sabian Holt. This would be a turnover on downs, making it Panther ball. North Lamar tried for the field goal, but was unsuccessful. And said the ball is caught in the end zone by the Lions and ran for a near 50-yard gain, only to be called back by a penalty. North Lamar tries for the squib kick but ended up leaving Greenville on their own 39-yard line. Greenville managed to push their way down to the goal line and in for a score in the fourth quarter, bringing the score to 35-31 Lions. In a last-ditch effort, North Lamar made their way down the field to try for the win, but the pass was broken up by a Lion defender, securing a Greenville victory. After the game, I caught up with head coach Darren Duke and asked him what he thought his team did well in such a close game. Uh, we just kept playing, you know, despite the obviously uh, huge uneven number of penalties called. But, uh, you know, we just kept fighting, kept playing. And it was a good game, good close game, and we came out on top. The victory against North Lamar puts the Greenville Lions on track for a great season.